right, Drake Riggs here for MMA Mania with Ray Cooper the third, the repeating welterweight champion of the PFL. Good to see you, Ray, man. How was the offseason treating you? Good to be back. Um, yeah, the offseason was good. Uh, this was relaxing, and yeah, um, I'm ready to get back in the season again. Soaking up the rays, I'm sure, in Hawaii and, uh, you know, doing some dirt bike and all that fun stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just hanging out with my family and um, just doing the fun stuff. That's it. Of course, of course. And, all right, man, got to ask you, like, you're looking to grow the hair back out. Everyone was so sad when you cut it last season. <laughs> uh, yeah, we'll see. I don't know. Um, I, I just focus on just training right now. Uh, if it grows back, it goes back. But, <laughs> yeah, not... I'm not thinking about that. Of course, got more important things to worry about. But as for last season, you know, a fantastic win, uh, you know, getting revenge there on Magomed, Magomed Karamov to win the title. Um, I mean, second time doing it, right, getting that. So would you say that was a more satisfying victory for you than the first time around, or are they the same? How do you kind of weigh the two? Um, winning any type of um, championship is an, is a satisfying feeling, but um, uh, getting the getting the match back with Magomed wasn't, wasn't um, topping on the cake, but... Um, Obviously, we won and won, so uh, I'm going to end up seeing him again sooner or later, so um, I'm ready for him again. Right, of course, man, and looking forward to seeing that potentially, see how the season shakes out. But, uh, you know, there was a lot of confusion, too. It seemed like right after the fight where, you know, there was people bringing up, oh, it's Ray Cooper's last fight in the PFL, all that kind of thing. I mean, what was kind of going on there? And obviously, you're back here now, but, like, it was it was a weird thing, you know? <laughs> um, yeah, I re we just uh, didn't know what, what was... Um, what was going to happen with uh, my contract and stuff like that? But um, uh, we're back here again. Um, uh, all I know is just, uh, I like I like to fight. Um, I like to compete as much times as the PFL um, is giving me, and they're giving me a lot of fights. So um, it's good to fight over here. You can't beat a million dollars at the end of it too. It helps yeah. out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it, it, it helps out a lot. And um, I just I'm just looking to compete all the time and um, always keep fighting. And not many people fight as much as the PFL guys, so it's good. Yeah, for sure, man. I know you've always wanted to, you know, get PFL in, the, in Hawaii. Do you think that we're getting closer there? Have you been pushing more uh, after you continue to win the titles? You got some leverage, man. <laughs> yeah, I want to. Uh, I've been telling them I wanted to bring the PFL to Hawaii. Um, they just had Bellator over there, and Bellator is the only, only one that's um, really going out there. But um, they don't have a, they don't really have a champion, and um, I'm a two-time defending champion. I've been there three, times in a, three, time, three years in a row, so this is going to be my fourth time, and I'm going to win them again, so... Um, I want that. I want that Hawaii um, card to be there this year. Yeah, that'd be a big event, big fun uh, thing to have. And obviously, though, coming up first, we got Carlos Leal. I mean, what do you know about him? Is this a guy that you've been watching, or is it just like, is how do you assess this guy? Is your first opponent of the year? Yeah, I really don't know anything about him. Um, he fought on the Challenger Series, I think, but uh, I really don't. I fought plenty of guys. Um, it's it's nothing new to me. He's just in my way, and um. Yeah, he's just he's just another guy in my way for to the title, and that's all that matters. I mean, you've seen it all at this point, right? So it's like can't really be too surprised by anything anyone brings your way, huh? Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm ready for everybody, um, anybody in this tournament. I'm ready for all everybody. You got to be ready for doesn't some it might happen like he might just fall out right at the last second. You know what I mean? So um, you just got to be ready for anybody, and that's what I train for. For sure, man. I mean, just with that in mind, is there anybody specifically in the tournament you're kind of like? hoping to fight at some point or just like we'll worry about that one at a time yeah no i'm not worried about anybody i pretty much fought everybody and everybody's style that there is so i'm not worried about anybody they they all should be worried about me mm -hmm. that's um that's it yeah well said man so all right last thing i'll leave you with ray always great getting to chat man i want to do a little bit of a game with you if that's all right it's uh knock out submit and have a beer with so you're gonna get three options here to place all these people in one spot so between gsp Kamaru Usman and Jake Shields, knockout, submit, and uh, have a beer with. Which ones would you put where? <laughs> oh. uh, I don't know. I'll knock out the Kamaru Usman and um, Joy St. Pierre and um, have a beer with Jake Shields. All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, best of luck, champ. Good to All see right. you, man. Thank you. <laughs>